Hi again, it's Ben here from Structured Parametrics. Today I'll run through a scenario dealing with one of the biggest challenges facing engineers, and that is of course, change. We all know how much time and effort goes into dealing with changes, whether it be from client, architect, or just plain old design development. To begin the scenario, we assume that the engineer has a basic analysis model running. Here we're using SpaceGas. We've converted this file over to Revit so that the engineering drawings can be put onto sheets. The conversion is here. As usual, not only the geometry, but also the member sizes and other information has been captured. Now, some new information has come through. The architect wants to chop off the top floor, add some second floor area, and add in a cantilevered entry structure. Normally, both the engineer and drafty would now have to change their separate models, but this is where we can help. We assume the engineer hears about the changes first and has updated the analysis model. As shown here, I've already added the second level and entry framing, and now I'll delete the top floor. Now to the conversion, and as can be seen, we've been able to isolate only the new changes to update the Revit model. The engineer's happy because his changes went straight into the BIM model without him having to mark them up. The draft is happy because we've not had to re-import the model from scratch and thereby run the risk of losing tags and other information. Finally, we can reverse the process. This time, the drafty makes some changes and we'll want to, the analysis model to pick them up. In Revit, I'll delete these three members. Then I'll go to this section and add some more bracing. I'll try to join members to nodes where I can but this is not essential and can be picked up later. And now onto the final analysis model showing just the changes made. No other part of the model has been affected, so loads and other information is just as it was before. And that's all for this video. If you'd like us to help your business, please get in contact. Information is in the video description below. Thanks for watching.